Hello, this is Brian, a technical writer at cPanel. Today, I would like to review with you the features of the WordPress Manager cPanel plugin. We released the WordPress Manager plugin in July of 2017 as part of the WordPress CP add-on. So, what is the WordPress Manager cPanel plugin? WordPress Manager is not included with the cPanel and WHM installation. It's a plugin that's part of the WordPress CP add-on that you can install with WHM's Install CP Add-ons site software interface. If you plan to deploy WordPress on your server, the WordPress Manager can definitely help you manage those installations. WordPress Manager can help you create and manage WordPress installations. In addition, you can change each WordPress installation's administrator password, configure automatic updates, and update a WordPress installation's database user's password. To get started, we should confirm that we've installed the WordPress CP add-on. Let's log into WHM, click on cPanel, and then install CP add-on's site software. I've not installed the WordPress CP add-on, so let's do it now. I will select the checkbox for WordPress and then click Update CP Add-ons Config. The system will display the process for the installation and display a success message when complete. Now we can log into our cPanel account. Scroll down to Applications and click on WordPress Manager. One thing to remember, WordPress Manager is installed and updated with the WordPress CP add-on. This means that the version of WordPress Manager is not controlled by the cPanel and WHM version. You can find the WordPress Manager version at the bottom left corner of the interface. As you can see, we don't have any WordPress installations. Let's create a new WordPress site and click Install. A new interface will appear that allows me to configure the WordPress installation. You can use the domain menu to select which domain on the account to install WordPress. This account only has one domain, example.com, so I will click Install. Once the system completes the installation, the interface will display a success message and provide you with a randomly generated username and password to log into the WordPress administrative interface. You should save the login credentials. Now that we've installed WordPress on example.com, we can view the installation in the WordPress Manager interface. To view the different configuration options for this installation, we click on Manage. A new interface will appear. Here we can see the domain, location on disk, the current WordPress version, and the configuration options for automatic updates. To see additional options, click Show Advanced Settings. The interface will expand to display the administrative and database configuration options. We can change the WordPress administrator's password, as well as the WordPress database user's password. I would like to thank you for joining me today in this review of WordPress Manager version 1.1.3. I've included the links to our documentation in the description below. For more information about cPanel, the hosting platform of choice, go to cPanel.com or follow cPanel on Twitter.